everybody. Hey, my name is Adam, and you can tell that I'm not from around here because I'm smiling and happy. <laughs> Hi, I'm from the United States of America. Remember? We invaded Iraq together? I mean, I say I'm from the United States, but my dad's side is 100% Italian, and my mom's side is 100% German, so I'm looking to marry someone from Japan so we can be the losing side of World War II. <laughs> I've been in this country for about two years, ever since I snuck in past the UKIP snipers to patrol your coasts. Mmm, benefits. And things here are so different, right? What you call chips, we call fries. What you call crisps, we call chips. What you call the NHS, we call communism. <laughs> Even our outlooks on life are different, right? Americans are optimists. At the end of a hard day, we're like, well, today was bad, but tomorrow will be better. Whereas you guys are like, well, today was bad, but tonight I'll be drunk. Even our, um, uh, uh, well, hard thing for Americans is um, back home we enjoy other people. <laughs> Whereas here, if a stranger starts talking to you, you're like, oh, I do hope I'm being mugged. <laughs> At least then it will be over soon. Our sense of history is quite different, too. I find a lot of people here don't know about the War of 1812, right? When marauding English soldiers set fire to the White House, and immediately a storm appeared and rained down water and put out all the flames. And if you can hear that story and you still don't believe that God's on America's side, <laughs> you might just realize that storms happen from time to time. Of course, we can't be too upset that you set the White House on fire, right? Because if Trump is elected, we need you to do it again. 